So good evening everyone, welcome back to my channel, Mystic Blue's Healing Hut. This is a general reading tonight for the astrological sign of Taurus. It is a weekly reading, it is going to be run from the 17th to the 23rd of August. It is a general read for Taurians, therefore if it doesn't resonate for you, the message is not for you. There may be parts that resonate. Please take what you can and use it for your highest good. So I am asking my guides to guide me today for cards relating to the astrological sign of Taurus for the week ahead, the 17th to the 23rd of August. Please guide me and help me to make the messages clear and concise for all Taurians that will come into contact with this video. So without further ado, I ask what cards are in the highest good of Taurus this week. So our first card is number 17, the lookout. Our next card is is the three of scrolls setting your course and the next card out is the king of scrolls hmm seems a bit of a theme there with the uh the lookout on the boat and then again set a new course on um the boat as well okay so firstly we have our first card number 17 the lookout now as you can see um there's a little man on top of the tower um in the crow's nest looking about him while there basically the ship is on fire there is a lot of chaos around this man there is a lot going on there is um it is a time where there is likely to be some loss However, what we need to remember is to look at losses as a way of making way for the new to come into our lives. So this is a turbulent time for um, Taurus at the moment, but believe that better was on the way. Now with this card, because of the way that the, look, the little man in the lookout is looking, um, we then have to look to the card that his binoculars are pointing to as we haven't pulled that card i will pull it now and we have been given number 14 initiation and the count saint germain so the troubling times may be surrounding your spirituality your initiation into becoming more spiritual, your opening up to the spiritual realms. I'm feeling this is causing turbulence amongst your friends, maybe your family too. People are not liking the way you are going. You know it's good for you, but others around you are not actually liking it at the moment. So basically at this time, you are being urged to try and find a balance. You always have to have balance in your life anyway. But while all this chaos is going on, we need a bit of balance. I would just advise you, because this card is actually in the first position, this could pertain to something that has already happened recently or is something that is going on now or slightly in the future. Um, everyone catches the energies at slightly different times, but this is the energy that is surrounding Taurus at this moment. So moving on, we have the three of three of scrolls set in your course so this card um, as you can see you're still on that boat um, you're still 
is still out at sea. However, if you look, the boat seems to have turned round and is facing a different direction. You're looking forward. There's a rainbow in the sky. So this is indicative of more peaceful times. So if you can manage to balance out this time, keep moving towards your good, but balance out what is going on, all the turbulence and everything in this first set of cards, karma times will come to you. In addition, because you're on the ship, it could um, be talking to you about a possible relocation. It could be talking about a possible vacation for you. Um, but at the same time, the fact that these three are working in harmony, it is talking about as well a possible partnership or an affiliation that is going to broaden your horizons bring more good to you um but whatever it is this is a very positive card um whenever you see a rainbow it is always a bright new start um the storms are over and good is coming your way now once again with this card we had the binoculars with this one we have the telescope now, this telescope is basically pointing to the next card. And with this next card, it is indicating what can either be um, a help to you or an obstacle to you at this time. As it is for you, it's a very good card. We have the King of Scrolls. Now, the King of Scrolls is basically um, a very wise person. They are um, he's a man that has a lot of wisdom. Now, we will take this as a masculine energy. Um, I, it could possibly be a man, but it could quite easily be a woman who is standing in her masculine energy. Now, this could be um, this is the person that is being sent to help you. This is the person that could open up your mind to new, bigger things. Very likely it could be someone in this group. But this is a good person to have on your side. This is a person that can offer you knowledge, can offer you wisdom, can offer you guidance. Whatever it is that you need in your life, this person can give it to you. Now, they might already been in your life but at the same time they might um, be coming into your life shortly it all depends on what sort of timeline you're on but there's someone who is in your life either coming in already in or um, will be with you very soon that will be able to guide you um, and help you through these difficult times they might open your mind to further learning, um, but whatever it is, this is a good omen. This is a good card. This is a good person that will be coming in and helping you out. So although this week has started with a lot of turbulence, you need to stay calm, stay balanced, not worry about it too much. Um, you need to be true to you. Don't let anyone try and sway you off of where you are. Keep looking forward. Everything is going to calm down. Everything is going to come good and everything will be peaceful and relaxed. Again, there could be holidays on the horizon. There could be relocation. Um, if that resonates with you, then please accept it. Um, but whatever is going on in your life, there is going to be some sort of partnership. Now, this person could also be related to love. Um, and wouldn't it be lovely if you could bring someone in who shares the same thoughts as you, that shares the same sort of ideals as you because this is someone who's very much on your level 
um, but they can open your mind a little bit further than you've already opened it. OK, so, yes, a bit of turbulence at the beginning, but things are going to calm, calm down. It, the whole plan this week is stay calm, stay balanced. Let the fires rage round you. But remain in your place of peace. And know that someone is coming into your life that is there who can help you that can help broaden your horizons and help you tread the path that you wish to tread. OK, so I hope that resonates for some of you um, Torians out there. Um, thank you for listening and watching and being here with me tonight. I hope it resonates. If it does, if you could click like, subscribe, comment and until I see you again, thank you very much again and I'll see you next week. Thanks. Bye bye.